Yankees take three out of four from the Red Sox in Boston. Let's go. Welcome to the channel where I'm talking all things Philadelphia Eagles, New York Yankees, New Jersey Devils, and Rutgers Scarlet Knights. Like the video and subscribe to the channel. That's right, Yankees fans. The Yankees take three out of four in Boston. Win this series. Love to see it. Love to see it. Now they now sit at 74 and 73, above 500, and tie with the Boston Red Sox for fourth place. They battle a lot of injuries. So pitching staff, the uh, offense, they found a way to win third and four. It's great. Now, before I get into all four games, if you're new to the channel, hit the subscribe button right now. Great, greatly appreciated. Talking Yankees baseball all the time for you guys. All kinds of videos and content. Subscribe. Greatly appreciated. Now, game one, it was um, we again a weird series with two double headers with some rainouts in Boston. Game one, a double header Tuesday. Yanks won three to two. It was zero zero ball game. Zero zero through the first three innings. Red Sox went ahead two zero to four. Yanks scored three runs in the sixth. That was all they needed to win the game. There, big sixth inning. Uh, then uh, Vasquez three and two thirds innings pitched. Pitching wise, three hits, two runs. Brito in relief, two and a third, three hits, no runs. Canley, inning scoreless. Peralta in the scoreless. Holmes gets the save. Got real dice. Bases loaded. Watch bases loaded. Been a huge double play to end the game. Love to see that. And again, like I said, hitting. It was three runs. Three runs in the sixth inning. DJ game tying RBI double. And Glaber Torres game winning two run single. Love to see it. Yanks win that game, 3-2 to take the first game of the series. First game in doubleheader Tuesday. Game 2 of the series. Game 2 of the Tuesday's doubleheader. Yanks won 4-1 to doubleheader sweep. Dow one zip after the first inning. Uh, scored 1 in the 5th. Uh, and 6th and 2 in the ninth. And the Yankees, Carlos Rodon got the win going 5 innings. Four hits, one run, nine strikeouts. The real quality strong outing for Carlos Rodon. Zach McAllister went inning, one hit, no runs. Uh, Anthony Mischewitz, I believe that's how you say it. I've got a butcher in that. Inning, no hits, no runs. Matt Bowman, inning, uh, one hit, no runs. So those guys, guys have been journeymen. Been, uh, some guys debut, been in the minors forever. Come in here, McAllister, Mischewitz. Bowman, all scoreless outings in that game, innings in that game, great. Nick Ramirez comes in, gets the save. So the real writers came in and pitching staff did a great job to get the win. Doubleheader sweep offensively. It was uh, Floriel with the game tying RBI single in the fifth inning. Uh, Bowers, a fielder's choice, put go ahead, run score, top nine insurance runs for the Yanks. Gator with Torres, RBI single. Austin Wells, not going to run, catcher's interference. As I mentioned, doubleheader sweep. They uh, went ahead above 500 at 73 and 72 after the doubleheader on Tuesday. <clears throat> and it rained out Wednesday again. So another doubleheader yesterday, Thursday. Yanks got shut out in the first game, five nothing. They had chances. The Yanks went 0 for 10 runners in scoring position. Could not come through. Pitching was Mike King real strong. Four and two thirds. Two thirds innings pitch, six hits, one run, eight strikeouts. Career high, I mean, career high pitch count in the season for uh, Mike King. Real strong job. Dre Weiser in relief. Two and a third, two hits, one run. Homer, solid job. Tough home run against him. Rafael down the pesky pole there, just hooks it in there. Fair. Bowman inning pitch, two hits, a big three run home run given up to uh, Trevor Story in the bottom eighth the innings. Again, I'm losing five zip, get shut out. Halk with six innings, four hits, no runs, seven Ks, four. No Red Sox, so they fell back to 500. Setting up the final game of the series. Game two yesterday's doubleheader. Yanks won eight to five. Didn't get to see any of this game, but Yanks were down two zip after the first inning. Then Judge been struggling. A grand salami in the second inning. Capped off five runs, second for the Yanks. Sox chipped away uh, and tied it as he got one in the third. Fifth and seventh, Yanks scored one in the eighth and two in the ninth. Love to see that. Clark Schmidt, oh, solid jobs. Fifth, five and a third, seven hits, four runs, three earned. McAllister, uh, two and a third, two, or two thirds innings pitch, a hit, one run. Can't even read my handwriting right here, but uh, Peralta inning pitch, a hit, no runs. Canely, two innings pitch, no hits, no runs, four Ks to get the save. Real good job, Tommy Canely. 
in the offense. Mayhew, RBI single in the, in the second, then Josh hit the grand slam there in the second, top eight. DJ, go ahead, RBI double, end up being the game winning RBI double. And Oswald Peraza in the ninth inning, big insurance, two run home run over the Monsters, first home run of the season. Love to see that. Clap it up for Oswald Peraza. Yanks win eight to five, back over 500. And that's 74 and 73, as I mentioned in the beginning of this pod. Now tied with the Red Sox after these four games for fourth place in AL East. So obviously compete with them to stay out of the basement and the season. And still have a chance to catch your Blue Jays, which would be cool. But you're seven and a half games back of the third wild card now held by Seattle. 15 left to play. Next up are the Pittsburgh Pirates in Pittsburgh this weekend. Should be a fun series there. Great ballpark, PNC Park, everything. Try to win some games. Garrett Cole getting the ball in the first game. And uh, yeah, so hey, one three out of four. You got swept by the Red Sox twice this season. So take it three out of four versus them in uh, Boston. Fenway Park was great. That's all I got. If you enjoyed the video, enjoyed the Yanks State 3 out of 4 for the Red Sox, give the video a like, subscribe to the channel, drop a comment. Have a good one. Let's go Yankees.